Okay, so we can pretty much guarantee ourselves a 1 HP Burning Elite by taking these two shops. But then we've taken two shops and one of them will be useless. But then we get a 1 HP Burning Elite, so then it's not useless. If you want that defect run, I only played part of first act and uh, already have Claw, Molten Egg, and Branch. No, I'm not playing that shit. If I get it naturally, it happens. I'm playing the Silent and thought I was playing the defect because I just mentioned it in chat, so I took 12 damage. <laughs> Someone mentioned the defect, and I was like, I'm playing the defect. I'll just hit him with the lightning orb. One HP, and my turn. <laughs> Damn, that was the hardest one HP fight I've ever had in my entire life. <laughs> oh, dude. You know what, dude? We're going to buy two cards and prove that these shops are useful. Trust me. We're going we're gonna to buy one thing at that shop, and then we're going to make sure we buy something at this shop, too. Leg soup is cracked. Like a regen <laughs> potion? <laughs> Yeah, like a regen potion. Very good. <laughs> In both sides of the pools. Darkstone, perfect. Unload is just really good damage. Yeah, I like an unload. Taking an unload at the beginning of Act 1, never a terrible idea. That's not poison. Barely on any points. You're fine. I think it was just because it was early in the stream. And because Chad's stupid and dumb. Can we keep doing more bets? Yeah, we'll do another one once I uh, get once I uh, get to act the act one boss. Slice is decent, but I think we already beat. I think we already beat Gremlin Knob, and that's my only um, that's my only issue right now. Is I I we need to make sure that we beat Gremlin Knob, and and I think we do simply with this potion and the boot. <laughs> this is not Gremlin Knob. Hello. <clears throat> oh wait, that <laughs> for some reason in my head that cons zero. Whoopsies. How much do I care about blocking here? I think a decent amount. I actually think a decent amount. I think we I think we can care about our HP in this fight. Yeah, taking four so that we can get more poison is like super duper in my opinion. Anagraphs, not the best because we're going up against Lagavulin, but not the worst. After image or a crippling cloud. Wait, we're getting so many rare. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, I do think I want another rare card. That's cool. Yeah, rare cards are pretty poggy. And I think we could take this elite. 29 HP. I mean, our, our relics right now from the elites that we've taken suck balls. So I think we want to take another one. <laughs> That's fine. Not gremlin knob. Kind of poggy. Hit him with one of these. Then we hit him with one of these. Then we hit him with one of these. And the next time we might use our, our cunning potion. Damn, chat. It's good thing I had that cunning potion. Because I... It's actually perfect. Like, it's actually kind of crazy. <laughs> uh, I'm actually not going to use the, the backflip. And I say actually like it's, you know, a hot take, but... I didn't want to draw into. Yeah, I didn't. I didn't want to draw into cards that might have been better to use. Next turn, you know, if I had drawn into those defense, wouldn't it have been that good. Uh, I'm actually gonna do this, since I expect that I'm gonna kill this guy in relatively good times. Reminds me of the Watcher when Frost ignores chat. Am I ignoring chat right now? I don't think I'm ignoring chat.
Chance been having issues because their G Dang's broken. Yeah, it's hard to ignore chat when there is no chat. <laughs> also, that's unlucky rolls. Did I win the ironclad run? You bet your ass I did. Maybe I'm feeling a bit ignored today. Maybe I just want some attention. How do you get the beta card art? Is uh, defeating the heart, right? Defeating the heart on whatever class. Yeah, we definitely want a second deadly poison. Two deadly poisons defeats Hexaghost. Remove a card? Yeah, like this stupid, dumb, non-rare card. Find me another rare card, please. Hello, I would like another rare card. Attention money. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Attention money is the best money. <laughs> it's actually weird that we're going to be, like, pretty much full HP against, uh... Against, um, Hexaghost because of our two... Our two relics that we found, which are really good relics, Panagraphs and an Eternal Feather, are really good. I actually want a third Deadly Poison, I think. Do I? Could find Corpse Explosion for the AoE. True. We'll just leave it up to chance. <laughs> Same. <laughs> mm. Mm-hmm. Five times six? Good, yeah. Maybe weakening him for next turn was better and not dealing six damage, but who's to say for sure? Next actually going really, really well. I didn't I didn't think that unload costed zero mana this time. Can I get a Pong and champ? <laughs> it's it's big for me, alright? It's it's big stuff for me. <laughs> Outside of the initial attack, I don't think we took took us. I don't think we took a single dot of damage. It's pretty good. Entropic brew. That's technically AoE. <laughs> But it's Wraith form. It's 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 gotta be the Wraith form. I don't even know if Wraith forms the play. I mean, Wraith form is pretty good. <laughs> oh, Wraith form is pretty good here, guys. Oh man, are we gonna win two in a row? That doesn't happen often on the stream because I suck and I mess around way too much. <laughs> you two boys, how's it going? Uh, it's just me today. I mean, and the doggo. There's no stream. Uh, this is me after my stream today. Uh, it's not that I forgot to do a call to action. It's just I wanted to try to be a little bit more personal. And, and I want to be very serious with the fact that you liking and commenting on the video uh, does actually genuinely help out in the YouTube algorithm. And, and I really appreciate it if you could do it. I'm in the comment section a lot trying to, to answer questions people might have about the game or, or uh, you know, just in general, giving some hearts to some people who are just genuinely being supportive. So I'd appreciate that. Hit the sub button if you haven't. And if you're annoyed by these call to actions, I'm sorry, they fucking work. If you don't do the call to actions, my sub numbers drop every single week, but I have to do them so that the sub numbers go up. And the majority of people who watch these videos sometimes aren't subbed. So maybe if you'd sub, I, could, I wouldn't have to do them anymore. I really wanted to go this path, but it's not many elites, dude. It's just only one elite. I don't like that. I do want more than one elite, I think, in this act. Or do I only care about one elite? I mean, our deck's already really good. I don't know. One elite is just... It's just... Yikes, you know? Major Kapow, Voodoo. Thank you guys again for the subs. Appreciate you. Sometimes when I'm, like, trying to think and, like, go over what I think is good and bad in a run, I immediately just, like, look over and I'm like, well, if I thank some subs right now, Northern I might be able to stall. I believe in you. Thank you, local loser. Let's start a prediction then. <laughs> Do you think I can win this? Yes. Oh. Right. 
Like, this route, we can just have a really high chance for <laughs> the fucking apparition event. Not a high chance, but a good chance. Whereas this route doesn't have a good chance for the apparition event. I think I'm actually going this way. I think we're okay with this. Thinking? Major huh. cringe dude. Day, 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 day. Thank you for subscribing. To go with what just happened, so you can understand. Happy New Year, give us um, the premium yeah, I'll draw content. Hi. Yeah. I gotta draw his dagger, sorry. He's weaponless right now. And then over here, I'm the silent. And on turn one, I drew a billion cards, and I played the one that's called Wraith Form. And then I killed this guy. And this guy did four damage to me. So I was like, well, then I'm not going to be able to kill him because I just killed this guy. But then I drew two deadly poisons that both costed up to three mana and an unload that costed zero mana. So I used them all because now unload does cost zero mana, unlike in Act 1. So then once they were, once that next turn, I drew perfect lethal against this guy. So they didn't get any of my gold and I got gold from them and they're dead. And then I stopped being the silent and I said, Puck. That is an AoE card. This card right here. I think we take it. I know that we have this shop here, but I don't want a random relic versus a relic that I know that I can get, like Apotheosis. You know, that's a really good relic for our deck. <laughs> Apotheosis might be a very good relic for us. I think. Pretty good relic. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Ooh, upgrading apotheosis. <laughs> I will put after him into my opening hand, though. Go ahead, bud. Yeah. How do I bet in the future? Uh, there will be a thing at the top of the chat that will allow you to bet. Only doing this. Definitely hitting this. I'm going to use my Entropic Brew. Might use it next turn. Apo costing three. Kind of cringe. True. <laughs> Good turn. All right, now we just have two more turns to kill him. Just kill him or head. Did I miss betting? Yeah, you did, unfortunately. I'm sorry. Hey, and load costs zero mana, just like it re previously has always. All right. Wait, we can't take two elites. A second after image? Kind of. <laughs> Dash is pretty good, too. We can take a second elite now, boys. I do think I want a campfire right now, though. Then we go this way. We want to put both of our after images in our opening hand because if they're both in our opening hand, they both can't cost three at the same time. What else do we want to upgrade though? Probably our other deadly poison, I think. Well, we don't need to upgrade nearly as much anymore, right? Because we have apotheosis, but there's also the chance that apotheosis doesn't cost. I, I think we go this way, actually. I think I think we go up and then we jump over there. Bottled tornado for our after image. <laughs> okay, we start with three powers in our opening hand. I don't know how good this is. <laughs> Uh, with that, though, I am going to go upgrade Wraith Form. <laughs> I, I am going to upgrade Wraith Form on that one. Just because we might want to use it on turn one sometimes. I think this is going here. Or is this going here? No, this is going here. This is also going here. This is actually a really tough fight for us right now. 
because the 11 <laughs> times 3 coming straight to our dome. Good thing we took that really cool AoE card. Ooh, dang. I didn't even see we could play Leg Sweep. That was my bad. I didn't do the basic arithmetic. Oh, my God. What are you doing, game? What are you doing, man? This is gross. You're gross. You're not invited to my birthday party. We have to play this now. And then hopefully kill him in the next four turns. Did I just win the prediction? No, no, no. You haven't won jack shit. Cross Prime is Pog. See? We still won. What are you doing, Step Game? Have I heard of Ring of Pain? A couple of people have told me about it. I looked on Twitch and it doesn't have good viewer numbers, so it's probably not worth giving a shot to, honestly. That's pretty good. Backstab? Don't want to start with another opening card in my opening hand, to be honest. And then let's rest. Big. Let's take another question mark. That is a fight. Good. Full innate deck. I don't... I don't think that's, like, <laughs> a very good thing. Uh, is it? No, it's definitely Poison Pass, I think. No, we could play Apotheosis here. Ah, dude, Apotheosis is always just... It's always just bad. What the fuck? <laughs> oh. Technically, you can overdraw with a Nate, though. Yeah, that'd be nuts, huh? Game sucks, dude. Don't ever take a po don't ever take uh, Sneko Eye chat. Sneko Eye is a terrible thing, all right? It's not good in the slightest. Anyone who tells you, nah, Sneko Eye pretty good, tell them no. Josie Juice, thanks for the follow, man. Did I thank you? I don't know. I have 25,000 points on L. Well, we did just find a Noxious Fumes. Oh no, Sneko, please. Whatever you do, buddy. Don't hit me with your snazzy Sneko effect. I'm gonna hate that so much. <laughs> oh, this stupid is dumb. Dang, dude. I hate this so much. Urgh. See, that's me being angry. <laughs> Now it randomizes things twice. Oh, true. <laughs> ah, dang. Big order on that uh, that after image. I lost the bet. Oh, well. You, I mean, there's still, there's still a whole nother act, friend. The game's not over. Don't lose hope now. Maybe I'll just turn off my monitor. I like reflex, actually. Especially if we ever get unload off. I think Reflex is solid. Very good start again, to be honest. Go ahead and hit him with this, too. Very good starting hand. I mean, obviously could have been better, but it, you know, it was decent. Fuck you, Apotheosis. We should have seen that coming, to be honest. Like, let's be real here. Um, let's hit this. Divine, think of the follow man. Yay, Twitch is alive again. Yay! Twitch is twi Yay, boy. Whoa. I think Wraith Form being innate is really bad since you never get it turn two. 
Hey, fuck you, man. <laughs> I think it's Wraith form time. I think I think I think it's Wraith form time. I think it's apotheosis. We want to draw here because we want to get back to our poisons, right? Dang. What the shot? Guy do be summoning, though. And we gotta deal six damage to him this turn. I did it. I did it again. And I did it a third time. <laughs> I was watching a YouTube video and I was. It told me to gum here. But I didn't finish it, so I'm gonna have to go back, have a golden stream. See you later, friend. I think Corpse Explosion is solid. Down day we. Velvet Choker or Empty Cage? Probably Choker, right? Yeah, it's just Choker. Choker can hurt us, but we definitely need energy. We definitely need energy. So I think that Choker will help us more than it hurts us. Like, it definitely will have its turns where it's like, dang, no. Oh. You know? Boom, 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 boom. That's pretty good. We still got one Wing Boot charge. See, that's why Wraith Form on turn one is pretty good. So we can just Wraith Form turn one. Everything about that? <laughs> Bet you haven't. What an idiot. Deadly poison number four? I don't think so. I think with, um... I, I, I think that corpse explosion is deadly poison number four. Go to the boss immediately. That sucks, dude. We could have gotten the key on the last floor. And I would have taken this, because this would have been perfect YouTube content. Fuck! F's in chat, boys. No, can't get the branch. Second leg sweep. And a centennial puzzle. <laughs> Both seem fantastic. Oh. All right, one in the chat if you think that we're gonna find a... Um, what was I gonna say? One in the chat, though. <laughs> a mummified hand. That's what I was gonna say, a mummified hand. Question for you. Would you ever consider uh, Mayhem and a Smork Ironclad deck? Mayhem has its place. But you always got to think of, like, you know, if you have a feed or if you have a Reaper, you know, something that needs to play something on a specific turn, that it can heavily shit on you if you get it off of the wrong turn. Yeah, I, I think that's fine. To be able to burn artifacts. Pretty good. Pretty good. Uh, I think we take the Elite first. I think we Elite first because we have Eternal Feather to heal. Yep. Flawless logic, Frost Prime. Frost Prime is so smart. Any other classes could use it? I think any class could use it. I, I, I think if we're talking... Yeah, I, I do genuinely think that any class could do decently with a Mayhem. Oh, raw. Damn, dude. I was looking for some poison. I didn't find no poison. We might.
might take a little bit of damage in this fight. I am I am considering using that potion as well. Do have to remember we have that. I mean, the, the this is a the two after images is really good. When we can get it off with relative ease, they are extremely good, right? Just gotta watch our number up there. Keep him queaking for a while. Perfect, dude. Choker? I, I, has there been a turn where Choker has hurt us? I don't think there's been a single turn where it's like, damn, dude, I would really have liked to have been able to play more cards. But Choker hurt us. I don't think that's happened. I think we just Wraith Form. In either run. That's true. We did have Choker last run as well. Should have drawn first. I mean, yeah, we could have gotten Corpse Explosion off. If it comes down to 2 HP chat, you're welcome to say, wow, Tristan, you suck. But if it doesn't come down to 2 HP, you all have to sub right now. So, fact. We once again have to deal, like, six damage. Wow. Damn, you guys. You all have to sub. Mayhem Whirlwind deck? Yeah, like, it can be good. I don't think that it's ever going to be terrible. Choke could be good if we didn't have Choker. So, it could be good if we... All right. Let's move on. I think we'll recall here. No reason not to. Nothing crazy that we want to upgrade. If we jump over, we can't jump back. So, we're going to stay on our line. Bottled Flame. <laughs> I have to take it for the memes, right? Like, I'm not allowed to not take it just because of the memes. And we're just going to put our unload in our opening hand. Oh, uh, we could put neutralize as well. Yeah, neutralize is fine. We have to take it. All right. Here we continue on our line. Now we could upgrade our neutralize since it's going to be in our start again. Yeah, let's fuck it. <laughs> Yo, Mr. Super Bowl, thank you for the follow. I want to take more elites. But at the same time, I don't want to take fights. So let's go this way and then do one last fight. One more fight, actually, is what I meant to say. One more fight was the perfect answer. In this uh, in this sentence of words and stuff. So. <laughs> ah, yes. A fight. That's exactly what I was looking for, actually. I don't know if you guys heard me correctly when I said that I wanted a fight. But I did say I wanted a fight. <gasps> Choker, no! Oh! Choker, no! Choker, no! That was the first turn. That was the first turn that Choker is... We wanted to play more cards and we couldn't. First turn. Uh, 12 poison kills him. Which, in turn, kills them all when you end your turn because then their armor goes away. Cool. Great throw number two, sure. <laughs> oh, no, it's not bottled. Probably sucks. Technically order. We, we could have gotten one more block, but... Do we want to play our Wraith form here? Is the question of the day. Is the question of the day is, do we want to play Wraith Form? Because we're not guaranteed to draw another one next turn, and there could be a lot of damage incoming. I think the answer is yes. I think the, I, I think the, I think the answer is yes. We all know the damage was coming. Yeah, I mean, I don't know whether we would have done all right that turn. Pretty simple turn. We are on a bit of a clock, but... Haven't been there before and gotten out of the sticky situation. can I say? 
I like sticky situations. I shouldn't have said that. You just, you know, there's sometimes when you just say things and then there's sometimes when you don't talk at all, you know? <laughs> just, there's just some times that are better than others to never speak, you know? <laughs> I forgot I voted for your prediction, but I hope you win. Hey, thanks. Dude, it's actually going to be nuts if we get two wins in a row. But I'm going to be very happy. I'm, gonna, I'm not going to lie. I'm going to be extremely happy if we get two Ws in a row. It's going to be the first time in a long time that I've gotten two dubs. Back-to-back -back dubs. Acrobatics is fine. Yeah. When it costs a lot, it's just one of the many cards that costs a lot. When it costs a little, it costs a little. And that's fucking awesome. Well, <laughs> we win. No, technically we don't. We need to... Okay, so we need to do this. 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 And then we need to apotheosis and shuffle our cards so that we can... Yeah, so it, we technically didn't win. F. Hold on. Okay, there's apotheosis. <laughs> Figured it out. And now we just need to get back to it by next turn. Next turn, we need to be back at it. We also has a bunch of poison, so like, we don't like, need to need to, you know? Or we can just draw it here. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. Or we can just, like, you know, draw it here. When you're not really fine. Or we can just draw it here. Yeah, drawing it here is actually pretty good. Now the question is once again, do we play Wraith form right now? I think Noxious Fumes is better. I think I think we play Noxious Fumes. Boom. Now I think we can drop a Wraith form. I think the Noxious Fumes was important, but we didn't. That's good. Technically, it was better to play Corsair Special. Now we can play our second race form because we made it cost zero. When it didn't cost zero, I wasn't a fan. <gasps> no, choker. Damn, dude, dude hasn't done the big attack once. What a pussy. <laughs> we could still die in this fight. Let's not, let's not take that for granted. Play smart, play consistent. The likelihood, low. That's the big attack, there she blows. But we do need to survive this next turn. Not bad. Not bad. We had RNG on our side. Ah, uh, no, RNG would have been drawing. Um, RNG would have been drawing. Uh, uh, that one. You know. <laughs> All right. What are we upgrading here? I think. I think. Acrobatics. Upgraded. Hog. Hi! All right. One after image apotheosis block. Good. Boom. Boom. Help. Time boy. More like. <laughs> Idiot. Nice. Good job. Boom, boom, boom. 
Get the heck out of here. I think we can unload on him. Blow, blow our load a little bit. not lose dexterity from the first wraith form i haven't played wraith form yet for me. Yo, Deuce, thanks, man. All right, we want a piercing well here. Um, fun fact about this guy, when they split and they remove all their debuffs, one of the debuffs is piercing whale, right? Um, so when they remove all their debuffs, they don't remember to gain the strength back at the beginning of the turn. So if when they're doing this right here, you use something like piercing whale or disarm it you know they won't it permanently i guess that this arm but like piercing whale if you know yeah permanently so you see how he has plus four strength right now so you see it chat he ain't gonna have it no more is what i'm trying to say i'm gonna go like this i'm gonna go boom and then boom and then he's gonna go to minus two and then he's gonna be like no but my debuffs and then he's gonna be at zero it's like a new fight Hmm. Um. Fuck. Actually, what the fuck? Wait, we might lose. Shit. This is not good. This is really not good. Yeah, we have to play race form here, but having all three of our deadly poisons in our hands at the time that we draw wraith form them all costing three and we need to play this wraith form kind of a yikes man we might die but we also might not so like you know there's the positive on that end of that is we might not die like if he just does 56 damage or 11 times three you know it's kind of, kind of a lot <laughs> Damn, these slimes be blocking for a lot these days. <laughs> That's tough. Like I said, might die, might not. Can he be split twice or does he only do it once? Whenever you bring him below half HP, he will bring himself back up to half HP on the next turn while simultaneously reducing or removing all of his debuffs. All right, we're not beating this guy. We fucking, we, now, wrap it up. I don't even want to, I don't even want to try. I mean, I'm going to because that's like my job, but I don't want to. We definitely got to play, we definitely got to play one of these. One of that, those bad boys is always happening. Then let's throw this out of here. Hit him like that. We're going to hit him with one of those. Losers pool pog jam liquid celery. Thanks for the fall, man. I'm focusing. Don't worry. I'm not giving up just yet. 
I just turned my hat on backwards. Try and get kunai value. Nope. <laughs> that shit ain't gonna happen. Alright, so this is always happening. This is always happening. I think, yeah, we do this. Boom. Goom. On a Sneko run, you mad lad. I am mad. Some might even say malding. Super bye, I think, in the fall. Watching the stream and the YouTube video at the same time. The ultimate Frost Prime experience. Hey, YouTube Prime! If he doesn't say hi back, uh, kill him. Yeah. Interest that I can say that because he said so. Is it because I said so? Or because we're cool like that? Oh, Xenocrat. Thank you for the brand new Prime sub, man. That is extremely nice of you. You know, some turns you're just not going to get off the poison that we want, and that's fine. You got to accept that stuff. Thank you so much, man. Also, see you on So in. Thank you for the follow. Xenocrat, thank you. You know, I said I didn't want to try in this fight. But I'm sure glad I did. Just look at me go. <laughs> I'm doing so good. Damn, it sucks that we don't get the piercing well, because you can do the same thing to him with the piercing well thing. But, uh, pooey. Pee pee poo poo. Ha ha. Stinky. I mean, I, mean, I, think, we, I think we play Wraith Form here, though. Ah, it's kind of cringe. It's kind of crazy. We'll just draw our other ray form. We can decide if we want to use that one. <laughs> Literally, wow, that was easy. <laughs> but God, he says. But Gah says the other guy in the fight. He's the other guy. I'm this guy. We can't use unload when we have the void in our hand. We need to remember that. That is big. Sorry that I laughed, but you gotta understand that it's an unfortunate but funny situation. Because you're most likely going to get the money back. Because banks nowadays and credit card companies nowadays, 
tend to not suck all that much when it comes to giving you your money back. When it comes to letting people steal your information and using your money on a whim, then that, yeah, that, they do tend to suck in that field. This is a bad hand. This is a much better hand. Oh, uh, is that enough? 12, 12 plus 9, lethal. Yeah, yep. Hit him with the strike, baby. Holy shit. Um... Chad, who remembers Frost losing $5,000 because of Taco Bell? Listen, dude, he's the Taco Bell bandit. Because there was an ATM inside the Taco Bell, inside the Taco Bell that he went to every single day and withdraw like $150. But we like to think that he just went to Taco Bell every day and spent $150 on Taco Bell. That was a lot better for us when we thought about it like that. Serpent Deer, thank you for the 10 gifters. You're fucking nuts, dude. Thank you. Wow. I'm very surprised that we won that fight. Thank you. Thank you for subscribing. All right. Let's focus up. I need to peep. I'm going to peep. I'm PP in time. It's all right. He still died of the heart. Hey, if I don't die to the heart, you're legally obligated to sub. I'll be right back. We're definitely upgrading here, but what's the best upgrade? Which upgrade is coolest? I'm just going to do Wraith for him just in case for some reason we can't play Apotheos. Apotheosis when it comes around. Excuse me. I just realized how much fucking healing we have. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Wow, wow. We're going to take this too. Well, eight plans plus intangible. <laughs> kind of good. Let me get a remove too. I'm okay with that. Yeah. Or do we like power potion? Power potion could just be wraith form. <laughs> I desperately want to get corpse explosion on one of these clowns. Also, just using Wraith form, probably not, the, not that bad because of we have, because we have so much poison in our deck. So I think it, I think it's boom, 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 boom. I think we're fine. I think I think we're good to go. Yeah. Not the best hand here. Not the best. It's not the best. Hit that. Hit this shit real quick. Actually, not the best. We're drawing all of our poison in the back half of our deck. They all could cost three and then we can't use them. Or they could all be usable. That's fine, too. I think it's fine to do this and then keep this poison. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Piercing whale will be good, uh, as well as uh, we don't want to play. We don't want to keep after image because it costs so much. Let's keep piercing whale. Luki, thank you very much for the 33 months, as well as Andrew. Thank you for the follow. We keep these two around. The most damage that we can deal next turn because we're going to need to deal just a teeny weeny bit. Getting a little bit closer down to the wire, but good. Because we did manage, actually, yeah, this is fine. We managed to uh, blow our load. As they say, they do say that. Damn. Not bad, not bad. Got a little bit close there, man. I ain't gonna lie. Always do that at the end of your turn so the boom loses their armor. Nice, nice. Toy, pretty good. Don't think I want a regen potion over a power potion. And yeah. Heading on into the fight, boys. Not a drop of HP. God dang. Corpse explosion stacks. Yeah. Yeah, it does. All right. All right, all right, all right. Okay. So, what's the play here? I think it's to defend first and then play after image, then play after image. 
And I say this because we do want a Procter Centennial puzzle this turn. That's fine. That's an okay thing to think about. But we want we don't want it. We want to get the full value out of it. And if we do this, we'll only have eight cards in our hand, so we won't get the full value out of it. But by doing this. And then playing this. Actually, doing this actually works as well, right? Oh, never mind. Never mind, I fucked it. Never mind, Chad, I fucked it. Chad, I fucked it. <laughs> Whoopsies. Chad, fuck me. Please, have sex with me. And I won't. Um, so that's more than the HP that we have. So I think I'm just going to go ahead and just safely say, probably a good idea. Let's see what power we want. And, I, and let me explain why I'm going to do this now. Why I'm going to actually use... Actually, maybe it's not better. Is it, is it better to try to get the healing out of it? The reason I'm saying it is because I want to I want to use this power potion no matter what before we play Apotheosis so that it's upgraded. And if it's something like Noxious Tomb that can start to slowly build up poison, it might be a really good idea to... Uh, maybe we just use it on the turn that we, we draw Apotheosis. It's fine. Apotheosis, no! We're using it. it, it we're going to take 30 better to just take 30 here i think is it it's 30 versus 22 this is nuts and we get it upgraded yeah very worth that's a bad use of our centennial puzzle in my opinion very worth nuts some say some have said nuts we gotta just remember we can just use cards. We don't have to worry about like maintaining our block because we have double after image. Ooh, kinda nuts here. Keep you two around. <laughs> Sir, that's 60 damage that you're doing. Did you know that? <laughs> is it time to go on the clock boys uh i'm gonna draw first probably be playing wraith form here right we can't weaken him unless we draw crazily here those were not crazy draws yeah i think we're just doing wraith form i think we have to is piercing the plate he has artifact so if we use piercing it will not work That, that, that cutscene was triggered by chat, by the way. They all type a bunch of shit. Yeah, the only way to do that is to do this. Uh, I think we keep you and nothing else. Actually, nothing else. It's just too costly. I just woke up still drunk. Hey. <laughs> How's it going? You know, not having Noxious Fumes in play might be the cost of this run. Whoever said that we were going to die to the heart? We can ban him whenever we want to, Chad. It doesn't. It can be now. It can be later. It's whatever. <laughs> uh, what I'm really hoping for here... Let me explain. You just got cool. What I'm really hoping for here is that he does the multi-attack this turn, and I can Piercing Whale well it. What a guy. Okay. And then we hit end turn. Let's keep these two around. Oh, what's in my pocket? Oh, yeah, yeah. I have uh, two sugar gliders in there. Sorry. That's probably really daunting to see for the first time like that. I don't think we use our wraith form here. Thirty-six. I think this is fine. Only lose one block off that. I think it's okay. We'll keep this strike for next turn. Wait, actually, yeah. Wait till after this run. I'll show you guys. Sorry, I'm, you caught. Ank, I'm, I'm very happy for Aaron, for Aaron, uh, the hosting. But I, I, you caught me at a weird time, where I'm like at the the peak of a of a of a run. You guys don't know what this game is. This is a deck building roguelike. 
um, where we build a deck in a roguelike game. It's a roguelike game. All right, doing the same thing here. I think we're, we have to use Ra uh, Wraithform this turn. Yeah. Oh, no, we don't. Wait, big. Okay. So we can use Wraithform next turn. It's really good. I think that means we double you, right? It's actually, like, crazy that he's doing the attacks in the orders that he's doing. It's nuts. All right, next turn we have to use Wraithform because we've run out of block. <laughs> Could have used that to not take that one damage, but I am... Not gonna cry over that milk that got spilled. Did Aaron just raid? Yeah, he did. One in the chat if Aaron do be kind of a cutie, though. All right. Good, good, good. Damn, dude. Survey says. Banda Foxy, thank you for six months. Happy New Year. Happy New Year, fam. All right, dude. Damn, this is actually our second win in a row. That's tough. That's crazy. Back to back. Back to back. Understandable. Ah, dang. Took too much damage because of the, the burn. Ah, damn. Ah, damn, god damn. Not bad. Day, 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 day. Thank, you Thank you for the three months, man. Welcome. Hello. Eldritch. That's Yako. That's Yako CMN. He's a bird in our campaign. I wonder how much damage. Oh, dude, Caltrops definitely was the reason we won that. Yeah. Yeah. We didn't win that without Caltrops, but we won. So I did it. I'm great. You suck. Um, We didn't see a Caltrops the entire run either. So, like, I probably would have taken one if I'd seen it. Come here, baby. Come on. Nope. You got to come this way. Are they sugar glider squirrels? The sugar gliders are not squirrels, but they're sugar gliders, yeah. Yeah. No, they're not squirrels. They're marsupials, actually. Um, marsupials, so they're closer to, like, uh, uh, koala bears and kangaroos. So they, Because they're, they're, the females have pouches. And then this is Bugs. He's currently peeing, by the way, if you can't see that. This is Bugs. Uh, Bugs is our new glider. We got him, like, four weeks, three weeks, three, four weeks ago at this point. I know, he wants to go back. He wants... No! Oh, did you drop your fish stick? The reason why he's so, uh... He's so much more squiggly is because he's not bonded. Um, they bond for life with other gliders, and also they can bond with humans. He just wants to go back to the pouch. Um, but, um... He is about 12 weeks old at this point. He's very young. And he's getting better with bonding with us. But... He... I think he's bonded to the pouch. Now, he's bonded to baby a little bit, but he's he's not fully bonded to me. He's not fully bonded to baby either. <laughs>